the story we have to tell is one of peace. We are creatures of peace. Our spirits run freely through time, witness to the history of our species. Horse energy is powerful, magnificent. We have no fight with you. We have been your friends through the ages. We are not beneath you, except when we carry you on our backs. The more I understand it, the land, the consciousness that is this place called me and called the horses. And we're here to, to bring forth this message. Something's blocking me and my head is just pounding right now. My quest has been to live a little girl's life because I never had it. I never got to enjoy my childhood other than with my horses. Animals are always in their truth, always guided by their instinct. You know, I've lived here for 10 years, and it, this land, this whole experience never ceases to amaze me. We are standing here now in the Crown Chakra. I've never seen anything like the relationships with these horses who are a true family, a true equine family. And they live this wild life, and then they live this incredibly tame life of domestic splendor. <laughs> it's like magic is real here, because it is. Her search was over, she had found love, and it would be with her always. It was with her in the wind and the trees and the sea and the sky and in every creature and in every man. She saw them all through her eyes and her eyes were filled with love. It's infectious. You can't help but not take it in and move forward and do something so great with our lives that God originally set out for us, but we got lost somewhere along our path. Imagine a world where all minds are joined in the quest for greater understanding. You and I can change the world one mind at a time.